Solitaire. TV's busted. Throw it. Won't turn on. I've been hitting this damn button all day. I think I make it. Yes, it does work. Bring it up here. And it doesn't work. It's your new sister. Did you see that? Yeah. I didn't do that. So? I think the TV's possessed. <laughs> Probably just the batteries. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up we got man? ghosts. Weird. What's up? The fuck? What the fuck you, bitch? Whoa, calm down, Krabby Batty. <sighs> I'm sorry, man. It's just another late night last night, and... My neck hurts like hell. What happened? I don't know what it is with this girl. It's like she wants me to go down on her every day. You need to spelunk her. What? You gotta spelunk her. The hell is that? It's easy, man. It's like your mom. I mean, think of your mom. Like what? Well, like when you were a little kid, you know, your mom would have you do the dishes. If you did a bad job the first time, broke a couple of coffee cups or something, she wouldn't ask you to do the dishes again. I guess not. It's the same thing, only slightly different. I mean, you gotta apply it to other women. Like Stacy Pooh, for example. If you would've done a terrible job going down on her the first time, she never would ask you to do it again. Well, fuck, I've already done it. It's too late now. Is it? I mean, think of your mom again. I'm not gonna think about my mom while I'm going down on my girlfriend. Nobody's asking you. Yeah, I'm not talking about anything like that. Can you? I'm talking about... If your mom's had you do the dishes for the last six weeks, you're doing a great job. No spots, no specks, nothing on there. This week, you break two wine glasses and three plates. She's not going to ask you to do the dishes again, is she? Didn't think so. Well, are you... Are you saying... Are you saying I should bite her pussy? Trust me, you would never see that pussy again. I'm not talking about anything violent here. I'm just talking about a little spelunking. Well, all right. You know how a lot of guys have deodorant in their bedrooms near their bed? I guess so. Well, you don't put your deodorant on in the bedroom. You put your deodorant on once you get out of the shower in the bathroom. So what do you think all that deodorant's there for? I thought you said I had to break the dishes. What the hell is this? Fine, dude. Fine. Alright? Just do it your way. Obviously it's working out. Alright. I'm sorry. Help me, please. Alright. So what do you think all that deodorant's there for? Uh, must be something else, right? That deodorant okay. is there for spelunking. That's the only reason. So the next time you're about to go down on Stacy Poo, take the deodorant and put a thick line under your nose. What the hell would I do that for? Fine, dude, fine, all right? Do it your way. All right, I want your help. All right. So you've got her going good now, and she's about to climax. That's when you do it. You stick your nose right in her ass. What? Right in her ass. And not just like one time. You gotta sort of nose fuck her for a minute. You gotta get it in there good. And keep in mind, to you, this is what she should like. So you're doing it, and after you're done, you gotta make her kiss you. <sighs> she's not gonna want to kiss you, because you just had your nose in her ass. So you gotta force it on her. That way, She'll never want you to go down on her again. That, my friend, is spelunking. Spelunking. It's a simple dish break, really. Only modified. Sure, your face smells like shit for a day. 
Okay, yeah, I, I guess that would fix it. Unless, of course, she likes it. Which, it's not gonna happen. It's hardly but, ever happens. Yeah, it could. But it's not likely. Although, I would advise shaving first. Done. Thank you.